if you've got your OCR GCSE computer science paper one exam in four days, make sure you pay attention because here are some of the misconceptions that students often have. Misconception one, can we use 1024 when conversing between the different data storage units? My answer to that is yes, you can, but you're just making life much more harder for yourself. Using the standard 1000 method isn't wrong, and you're actually encouraged to use that since you're not allowed a calculator in the exam. Misconception two, is it seven bits or eight bits for ASCII? This one caused a lot of confusion in the previous video. For your information, ASCII is eight bits. Check the spec, there's no more extended ASCII. ASCII is just eight bits. So make sure you remember that one. Misconception three, is there a particular way of structuring the eight marker question? No, not necessarily. Of course, at the end of the day, we're trying to impress the examiners. So if it reads better, you automatically get more marks. So you should structure it nicely so the examiner is impressed. How I recommend you structuring this is a line for the introduction and then separate paragraphs for each of the issues. And inside of those paragraphs, you have advantages and disadvantages since it says discuss. So make sure you do that and maybe a line to conclude the question. On the screen is another example of one of the questions that I went over in the predicted paper. If you have any more misconceptions, leave them in the comment section down below and I'll address them in the live stream on Sunday. Stay tuned for more details.